jazz fans, uh, Rick Hirsch here with another installment of Free Chart Friday. Uh, I've got a minor blues for you. It's a nice medium tempo G minor blues of mine entitled Steady Eddie. And, um, you know, it makes a nice alternative to some of the really uh, well-worn, much played, much loved standard minor blues tunes like um, Mr. PC or Equinox. Actually, tempo-wise, fits really in the middle of those. I'll tell you a little bit about the song. There's not too much to say. You know, it's a pretty standard 12-bar minor blues form. has a very simple melody, not riff-like. It's more of a sort of extended sequence, downward sequence of a, of a one-measure melodic cell. And it has this uh, persistent half-note thing going on in the bass. Uh, which just gives it a very specific mood. It sounds nice when the drummer uses brushes. It also sounds nice on sticks. Um, uh, I believe, as I kind of dig back and try to figure out where I got the idea for this from, I, th I think I heard a similar mood on a Dave Douglas tune called uh, Blues for Steve Lacey. I'll have, to double, I'll have to fact check that, but I th think that's what it was. Um, so about all I have to say about the tune itself. Look, go download the lead sheet for free from my website. You've got transpositions in C, bass clef, E flat, and B flat. Um, the half note bass line is on the lead sheet. If you want something a little more substantial, I do have a premium arrangement of it available, orchestrated for three horns, um, as you hear on the recording behind me. Um, well, not really behind me, behind my voice, beneath my voice. Well, you get the idea. Um, orchestrated for three horns, I've got a bunch of different interchangeable horn parts that come along with it, as well as some notated rhythm section parts. It's really helpful if your piano player uh, needs a little help with some voicings that are in there, um, as well as I think maybe some suggested background riffs for the horns, uh, and a coda, as I recall. Anyways, that's also available at my website. But nonetheless, go ahead at the very least get the free one. Enjoy it, stick it in a set, see how you like it, and uh, drop me a line, and I'll catch you next time.